I'm going to speak to you just briefly about how to handle an asthma attack without an inhaler. Have the person who's having um, an attack or asthma attack um, exhale stale air as slowly as possible because the airways are already turbulent. They're already narrowed down and it's going to be very difficult for the person who's having the attack to be able to exhale slowly or to get air in. Either way, they're going to be very apprehensive. They're going to be trying to struggle for a breath and they have no medication with them and no inhaler. This is what this is about without an inhaler. So have them inhale slowly as possible to not create any more turbulence in the airway and keeping the patient or the person who's having the attack as calm as possible and you also remaining calm so that you don't upset the patient further. Allow the patient or the person to sit on the ground if they have to sit down. Lean into you to be comfortable or to sit in a chair and lean into you that way. Uh, sometimes what will happen is uh, someone will find it more comfortable to perhaps lean forward and put their elbows on a table if that's possible. And with that in mind, it allows some of that dirty air which is trapped in there, the chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, which asthma is a component of, that would be able to escape a little bit easier if you can slow the person down from breathing too heavily. Speak softly to them and, and make sure that you call 911 while you're comforting the patient, while you're tending to their breathing, trying to get them to slow down, and then stay with them. Don't leave them.